multiple mics. Voila. Thank you, Jamie. Thank you. Thank you, Daniel. <laughs> I'm a little bit short for that stand, so I'm going to stand by it. <laughs> uh, today, we are featuring a couple of nonprofits in our nonprofit spotlight, one of which is the Intendance Film Festival, which we are hosting here on June 8th and 9th. That's next weekend. I have a video that we are going to show for you um, right now, I believe. If not, I just continue to smile up here. Um, I'll also be interviewing. Um, Let you have any more. The anesthetist's already on our way. Believe me, you don't want to upset the anesthetist. so long to return to me. here at Denver Open Media, and you were just watching a couple of clips from the last nine years of the Intendance Film Festival. Um, those were some fan favorites, and I'm here joined by Casey Elliott. 
She is a co-director of the Intendance Film Festival and the vice president of the Intendance Film Festival nonprofit. Hi, Casey. Hi. <laughs> so um, we have the festival here next Saturday and Sunday. Friday, Friday and Saturday. Saturday. Yep. Okay, on Friday June and 8th and 9th, they'll be here at Denver Open Media, 700 Calamath Street in Denver. Um, can you tell us a bit about Intendance? Yeah, so Intendance Film Festival is a community-driven indie film fest. We show local films, um, we show student films, we show films from all over the world. Uh, we're kind of all-encompassing in our genres, so um, from some of the clips you saw, I mean, we have animation, we have sci-fi, horror, um, comedy. Uh, we were the first film festival to have music videos as a category, um, so we also have music cool. videos in there. Um, just a little bit of everything. Uh, Crazy Mountain Brewery is going to also be there for us. They're I one know. of our um, sponsors, and of course, Denver Open Media is a fantastic sponsor, and they have been for the last few years. Oh, oh gee, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're really excited to host you guys here. Um, have you had a chance to preview a few of the films, or um, what does the process look like for getting into this festival? Um, so because there are so many categories and just so many different ways that people can submit their films, we do see a lot of films. Um, this year we're going to have 41 films in total, um, and that doesn't include a special fundraiser we're doing on opening night. So, um, opening night we're doing a Sheridan family benefit. Uh, Patrick Sheridan was a just big, uh, icon and lovable person in our local film community and uh, he put so much into community film um, and uh, teaching acting to kids and just everything. I mean, if you knew him, he was an amazing person. He, he passed, you know, not that long ago. Um, so we're doing a fundraiser for his uh, family and uh, the money, uh, tickets are $10 um, at the table when you come in here at Denver Open Media, and all that money goes to his family um, during that. Yeah. So we have 41 films plus the benefit films, which should be a uh, couple of films, like 10 films, an hour's worth of films. Yeah. So the benefit will precede the Intendance Film Festival, or will it wrap it up? It'll kind of precede it. It'll be almost running at the same time uh, because we have so many films and so little time, so to speak. We are doing two separate screenings, so people there will be people that will be there for the benefit, and okay. then we'll also have, because we'll have two studios going, we'll have regular festival films showing in another um, studio for people that aren't going to be there for the benefit. Okay, well, that sounds like a really... Really great um, opportunity to help, you know, support local local art, especially and a family that has been involved in the arts for so long. Yeah, it definitely, it definitely means a lot to us, and and that's why we're doing it. And um, we will also have some live music on Friday night um, okay. by Elizabeth Rose, and uh, some karaoke on Saturday if you guys are <laughs> feeling <Karaoke>. it. <laughs> uh, Crazy Mountain will be sponsoring the karaoke. <laughs> Are you going to sing? <laughs> I am. I do. I, I try to get it started every year. And, uh, oh, that's awesome. That's you know, great. <laughs> but because no one else wants to be the first one up there. So I just yeah, kind of do Yeah, it. yeah, yeah. He who throws the first stone. That's yeah. right. That's right. <laughs> Sings the next song. That's the, Sings the next that sentence song. goes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great. Well, um, what are you most excited for, uh, for attendance? Um, you know, is it the crowds? Is it a certain film that you've had, at, like, you know, just in the back of your brain that you got to preview? Because um, a lot of these will be debuting, right, at the festival? Yeah, yeah. This will be the first time a lot of the films show. Um, God, what am I most excited about? That's I've never been asked that before. That's a new one. Cool. Um, <laughs> I am just excited to be there with the indie creatives and the people that love indie film as much as we do. So there are people that are there showing a film for the first time that have never made a film. that are like, I made it into a film festival. And it's great work, and they've just never shown it anywhere before. And so we're kind of that outlet for them. And students that are like, this was my favorite project, and I want to show this to the world. So I like being there and being with the people that are excited about their art and want to show their art to the rest of the world. Sounds really good. Um, well, is there anything else you'd like to say about attendance before we kind of wrap up the interview? 
Join us next weekend. It's uh, two hour block tickets are 12 bucks. That's two hours of indie films. And we have beer and food and a great time and karaoke. And I'll sing first, don't forget. <laughs> so I'll be there for that. <laughs> All right. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, Casey. Yeah. And uh, you're welcome to take a seat and watch the awesome show. Thanks. Check out Intendance next weekend. Um, our next nonprofit spotlight will be joined by Westward. Will Wyatt to Sobel will be joining us, and we're going to throw to a quick video for the Westward Music Showcase right now. <laughs> 